My name is Peter Dickey. I'm President and CEO of Quantum Rare Earth Developments Corp. Quantum is in the process of developing a substantial niobium deposit in the state of Nebraska, the southeast part of Nebraska. It's a commodity that's in high demand, in growing demand, and it's not found anywhere else in the size or quantity that we found it in Nebraska. So we believe it's very integral to the development of the state and the economy. Niobium is a mineral that's involved in everybody's everyday life, although the majority of people have never heard of it. It's used primarily as a steel additive and is in very high demand to create what is called high strength, low alloy steel. This is a lighter steel product that can produce significant savings in fuel economy with automobiles, can produce significant savings in construction costs with large infrastructure projects such as bridges and buildings. And perhaps most importantly, it's also used as a super alloy in the defense and aeronautics industry. Quantum can have a significant effect on the economy, both in Nebraska and in the United States in particular. This is a commodity, as I mentioned, that's 100% imported into the U.S. There's no other deposits of a similar size. And it is a sizable market with approximately 10,000 tons of this material imported every year into the U.S. And that figure is growing. If we're successful in moving ahead, this will create literally hundreds of jobs in the local economy, as well as numerous other indirect jobs as a result of the commodity being sourced within the United States as opposed to being 100% imported, which it currently is right now. As most people know, there's many challenges involved with mining. And our current uh, challenges that we are facing is just part of the normal mining process. At the moment, we're undergoing metallurgical testing of our core material, which we obtained through our drilling program last summer. And this will, in essence, tell us what our recovery rates are for niobium out of the ore zone there. Following that, we have already scheduled a update to our resource calculation to expand upon our sizable high-grade resource that we already know of and of course this will all, all fit into a preliminary economic assessment report which we plan on delivering in the hopefully in the first half of 2012. And this tells us really the economics of the project. Yeah. From a long-term perspective these are necessary steps that we must take to develop a mine, which every mining company goes through. And based on our internal reports that we've already produced on this, we feel confident that a third party will be able to confirm our numbers and really show the value that we can unlock in the southeast part of Nebraska. We think this is an opportune time for people to really become aware of the niobium market, the potential for a in-country niobium resource and supply chain, and also to become aware of Quantum as we develop this company. At Quantum, we're focused on developing a niobium resource within the United States where production has not occurred in over half a century. This is an integral part of the economy, although very few people know of the, the mineral, and it is also a strategic metal that is subject to stockpiling efforts in current legislation. This is a mineral that, is, as I mentioned, is integral to the economy. It is 100% imported and with a successful development in southeast Nebraska, we plan on reducing that import requirement and lessening the dependence on international companies.